there should not be that much dissonance between oh, no. the quality of the oh, in-game cutscenes and the FMVs. So sorry. You were right there and we still let this happen to her. It's amazing, like, all the, the FMVs bullshit. in this game. And then you go back to the cutscenes and they're like this. Though she avoided death, her neural network, the rough equivalent of her brain, has been completely shattered to pieces. We need the expertise of Vector's 3rd Division if we stand any chance of recovering the Y data. This crisis isn't just 2nd Milch's problem anymore. On behalf of the entire government, I am hereby requesting your official assistance. Momo, all this to protect her father's wishes. Very well. We would be honored to assist you. Besides, Momo is a close friend. This is terrible! I think it's going to take a while to get help from 3rd Division. I hope Momo will be alright until then. Alan, could I get you to arrange the equipment transfer from 3rd Division? Huh? Sure, no problem, but are you planning on... Yeah, I'm going to go. I can't just sit here and wait. I knew it. Just so you know, you'll be exceeding your authority. I don't think that's a good idea. Don't worry, I'll take the blame. Nothing will happen to you. Thanks for your help, then. Hey, wait, Chief! If you did the GS quest before, there isn't any of them to do now, so we can just go. Chief! Chief, wait up! Alan? I went on ahead and ordered the equipment from 3rd Division. They asked what we intended to do with it, so I explained it to them. Hey, didn't I tell you I'd go myself? It's alright. By the time 3rd Division arrives, our work should be complete. Alan. Please don't say you'll go by yourself. I'll go with you. Alright, let's hurry. I have to hurry. I'll be right there, Momo. Oh, wait, no. Why am I going here? That's not where I need to go. What are you talking about? What reason could there possibly be for the immigrant fleet to deploy ships to Second Milsha? Now, now, let's not be so quick to judge. Let's at least hear what they have to say. Thank you for allowing me the opportunity to speak. Once in this region of space, there existed the great land of Milsha. As you all know, when the unfortunate events occurred 14 years ago, that land, along with mankind's greatest treasure, was sealed away like a cursed past. That greatest of treasures originally belonged to all of mankind. And we of the immigrant fleet had been its caretakers from time immemorial. Now wait just a minute. All Zohar activity currently falls under the jurisdiction of the Federation. You aren't trying to monopolize that great treasure for yourselves now, are you? We wouldn't dream of it. All I am saying is, there are those who would claim it as their own. Are you insinuating that the Milshan government would do such a thing? They have clearly used the events of 14 years ago to justify their mobilization. To demonstrate that they have summoned the great evil, Proto Merkaba, in an attempt to reignite the flames of conflict across the galaxy. They 
intend to take advantage of the chaos of war to use the relic in old Milsha for their own self-interests. In response to these usurpers, the Milshan government, we propose to reclaim our long-standing traditional rights to be the caretakers of the relic. The incident you speak of was perpetrated by the UTIC organization. All accusations against the Milshan government were officially cleared, were they not? I believe there was even evidence provided by Vector. Yes, but there are also rumors that Vector is supporting the Milshan government. I wonder just how trustworthy Vector's data really is. Uh, what? Where huh? is the Milshan so, sorry, I fell asleep. representative now? Where is Representative Helma? Doesn't she have anything to say in this matter? It's been a long time, Lieutenant General. Or do you prefer Representative Helmer of the Second Milshan Parliament? The latter, because that is what he is. The old way is fine, Captain. It suits me more. Well, Captain, aren't you going to ask me why I've come? I've got a fairly good idea. You want to buy some books, fine. don't you? Then I'll get straight to the point. Captain, I'd like to enlist your services once again. I believe you already know Kanan. Yes, it's been a while. The data you entrusted to Kanan. I want to find out the truth it holds. Isn't that what we're doing right now? That evidence was obtained illegally. It won't stand up in court. I don't care. If I can just find out who our real enemy is, that'll be more than enough. I want to know, Captain. Lieutenant General, these days I am but a lowly used bookseller. In six I'm months, sure I'll be I'm something else. Of meeting your expectations. This is... The truth will surely be of great benefit to you as well. Lieutenant General, you must realize that in order to unravel the data that I passed to Kanan, we have to go back there. I assume you are aware of what that means? Yes, they've been hinting at it for one and a half games I'm now. Well aware. And I'm ready. Shia. I thought we were getting someone from the third division. This is outside of first division's jurisdiction, isn't it? Yes. Normally, the 3rd Division would have sent someone, but we were closer. It's just easier for me to take care of it. Besides, I've already had everything we need transported over. Don't worry, we've got the technical side covered. You can relax. Honestly, Chief, you're so stubborn. You know, you're gonna have a hard time with the 3rd Division later. Yet, in spite of that, Alan, you're still right here helping. What? Uh, well, I can't leave it all to the Chief now, can I? Junior, we want to save Momo too. Or do you think Alan and I aren't reliable enough? Uh, no, no. Well, I don't know about Alan, but I'm glad you're here, Xion. Hey, what is that supposed We're to be? short on time. As soon as you're ready, <laughs> well, let's go. Right. Is everyone ready to dive? Momo's subconscious domain is likely uh, in a highly unstable state. 
I don't know what dangers you may face, so you should make sure you're well prepared. As soon as you're ready, I'll begin the dive. I'll wait here, so just let me know. If there's no problems, I'll commence the dive. Are you ready? All right, then I'll initiate the dive. The dive subjects for this operation will be the Chief, Junior, Chaos, and Ziggy. I've also arranged for Cosmos data to be simultaneously transmitted from second division into the encephalon. But unfortunately, sure she still looks like shit be because they haven't That's updated her model. Good thinking, Alan. I have something we, we can do about Mizrahi's that, though. Mizrahi's subconscious domain, which is modeled after Sakura Mizrahi's memories. Like the dive into Cosmos Encephalon, there is a possibility of resonant memory playbacks with those who've closely shared time and space with her. This time. That'd be me. Yay! Junior? Dr. Misrahi told me that Sakura suffered from a central nervous system disorder. Did you have contact with her? I did. The going theory was that Sakura's symptoms were somehow connected to unusual wave pulses within the UMN. She was being attended to at the Yuriev Institute where her treatment was also a part of the URTV's UMN link training. Sakura, the girl Momo was modeled after? I'd like to ask you something. What is Udu exactly? Why were you URTVs created? To fight it? I don't know, Ziggy, why were you created? Udu is the Unus Moon Destrive operation system. From the name, it might sound like some UMN control AI. That thing was not created by human hands. Yes. That thing? That's no AI. Well, we know what it's not. Nothing that simple could have created a space-time anomaly. Exactly. He just picked the name because it sounded good. At first, they tried to make us believe it, too. They said it was an artificial consciousness within the UMN that was carrying some kind of dangerous waves. But that was a total lie. Our father, Dmitry Yuryev, knew about it from the start. Okay, I gotta admit, young Elbita is pretty cute. All right, open spiritual link. All URTVs match your individual waves to mine. <laughs> Here it comes. <laughs> Do it like in training and you'll be fine. We think of them as mental waves. The resulting antiparticle collision with us will be converted directly into thermal energy. Ted knew everything. <laughs> that bastard! The link is already complete. We can't stop it. No! Ruby, no! Don't let go! No! I'm cutting the link! <laughs> Don't let go!
So what is it? It's an energy from a higher dimension. An entity humans couldn't possibly control. It's ironic that we URTVs are its anti-existence. Yet, we were never told what it really is. Voodoo. Cephalon construction complete. We can open the interconnection at any time now. Okay, go ahead. All right, everyone, just relax and enjoy the trip. Don't worry, I'm a pro at this. Starting preparations for interconnection linkage. He's right. We're in good hands. Fan secured. Opening cage partition. Aww. System monitors are showing normal values. Cosmos data transfer confirmed. Initiating reconstruction. Confirmed transport of external data. Readying prime field formation. All preparations for direct approach complete. All right, let's go. <laughs> Cosmos, you look like shit. The world inside Momo's subconscious domain. Sakura's inner world. Momo. Momo, you're okay. Hey, can't you hear me? Say something. It's no use, Junior. She's not going to answer. Why not? She's right there in front of us. You literally found her exactly like her this in the last game. Is offline. Plus, her neural network's completely fragmented. She can't understand anything we say. Luckily, she can still fight. She may not be able to even hear us right now. No. Damn it. The Momo you're seeing here? is nothing more than a product of her own subconscious. Even if she were able to take some sort of action, it would only be a simple reflex. Like fighting Momo. enemies with a bow? Even in her current state, she's still trying so hard to help us. What are you doing? We don't have much time. Do you want to worry Momo even more? Right. Momo. Just hang on a little bit longer. Come on, Momo. Let's go. I swear, I'll always keep you safe. Let's uh, make our own party. So... This is my ideal party. But, uh, we can go to status. Swimsuit. 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 Yay. I'm gonna edit the skills and everything too. Okay, I'm gonna use Momo as my avatar because I think I want to do those cute little heart destroys on the... Her destruction animations are the cutest, I think. I, normally, I, of course, would be Cosmos, but she looks awful because she has not received her character model update yet. But then I will, of course, use... Her. Of 
course she has a music box, because every dead girl has a music box. There's a jewelry box decorated with pretty shells. Look at that TV. Why does this house look like a 90s house? Is that... Momo? No. It's Sakura. Hurry up. So dark. It's kinda cramped in here. I know. Just shut up for a second, will ya? I'm scared. Turn the light on. Cut it out! Quit moving around so much! Ow! Quit freaking stupid! What is this place? Oh, we must have messed up the connection coordinates. Alfredo, you stepped on my foot in there! Huh? I did not! Uh huh. That's us 14 years ago. 14 years ago, I was the same age. No way, that was your foot! That girl is our contact not. target. No the coordinates way, were correct. That girl, she's looking at us. Uh, I'm I'm sorry. Uh, you guys. Next time, we're coming through the door. Wait. Huh? You guys, you can hear what I'm saying? I'm so happy you came. <laughs> 